What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have another unboxing. I know it's um, sort of like an older product I guess, but it has been a product that I have been wanting for some time now. Uh, it is the iPad Mini 6 and you guys probably have seen my videos that I've done on my iPad Pro 12.9 uh, inch 2021 model or 2020. I believe it is the one before the M1 chip came out, so it is the the one without the M1. So. Uh, yeah, so the thing with that iPad is is that the use of that iPad has become less of an iPad and more of a laptop replacement and that is what I'm trying to get back with this product right here specifically. Uh, that other iPad was way too big in the hands. Uh, I couldn't lay in the bed with it. It was just huge. It was it was literally like a laptop screen, a 13 inch MacBook Pro screen, basically. Uh, I want something back that I can carry around the house, one handed, uh, lay with it in bed, and not have to worry about it falling on my head, the weight, and everything like that. And then plus the portability of the iPad Mini is insane. So I'm gonna be doing a quick little unboxing right here. And, uh, yeah, I'm telling you guys sort of like what my thought process and like how I got in and where I got it and all that good stuff. So, let's start with the unboxing. So we have this pull tab right here. And, yeah, I picked this up from my local Target. I did a price match from uh, Amazon so I did price match from Amazon so on Amazon they had it for 450 and I press match the in store for uh, 450 because they wanted uh, like $500 and I don't think I was gonna pay that at all so yeah now we've taken out of the the box and let me just show you guys what else it came with the usual Apple stuff we have the design by California Designed by Apple in California, sorry. Um, iPad mini. The little get started brochure. Uh, tap to wake. App switcher. All that good stuff. Um, do we have the Apple included stickers? We all know that. Um, other than that, that's it on that box. We do get a USB-C charger. I believe this is how many watts? Actually, sorry. Let me just check right here. 20 watt charger. That is pretty good. And we get a USB-C to USB-C cable because the iPad mini is USB-C enabled. So that is pretty good. We can put that to the side. I already have a whole bunch of chargers like that. And uh, might as well just do the initial setup. So I'll let you guys, I'm going to pan over to when the iPad is turning on and stuff like that. So in the usual fashion, the Apple logo uh, will boot up, and then we will get the the hello in all the different types of languages. So let me swipe up. I'm gonna go with English. Basically, this setup is universal from Apple. the The setup has been the same for the past, like I don't know, it's seamlessly and connects to all your devices. But let's just go through it. Uh, I want to set up manually. I want to set up this iPad. Um, let's see, Nick Gear 5G, uh, okay, and I think this is it, uh, yeah, if you guys find my freaking thing, you guys can know what I, my password is, I don't have a quarrel with that, you guys already know my other password, you guys are always saying it in the comments that I showed it, so, okay, no, I'll probably skip that, actually, so, well, we're right here on a waiting screen. I'm gonna skip over this stuff. Continue. I will set this. So this this is an interesting feature about the iPad Mini that uh, I have not had in a, an Apple device in years. That is the Touch ID. So I will try to set up Touch ID right here. Left and rest your finger. It's been so long. And in my personal opinion, Touch ID will uh, always be superior to Face ID. Just because of the fact that um, uh, you can use uh, Touch ID on a flat surface and stuff like that. And uh, Face ID is more 
more of a like you have to physically take it out of your pocket and stuff like that it's just it was overall there was no need to switch it up in my personal opinion but Apple knows best and Apple is soup the one in charge of it uh, I will um, I'll set up later so switch to the four and this is my password Let me zoom in on this. There we go. Uh, don't transfer. This is going to be basically a new iPad. So, this is the part where you guys, guys going to put your Apple ID. So, I'm going to pan out for that. Oh, dang. All right. Um, let me look for my phone. So once you set up your Apple ID, you basically get here. Oh, okay, so basically I'm going down the process of customizing it myself. And voila, we are now done and the customization and the setup process was seamless actually. And I really like this home screen that layout that they did, but uh, I might switch this up. And if there's any videos you guys want to see on this iPad mini, whether it be uh, setups, uh, what I use it for, day in the life, uh, review, that will be coming out shortly. So please remember to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. And uh, I forgot to mention that I wanted to let you guys know that this whole video was edited on the iPad mini. I know most of my stuff isn't very highly edited, but I did do it on the iPad mini. So... Uh, very powerful device, very, very strong, and yeah, so stay tuned for next videos.